Prashant Mantha here with Broadcom's Blog Squad, and today I'm here with Shane Buchanan and Alan Messer, and today we're going to talk about DLNA in our homes in the future. So what exactly is DLNA? That's a great question. DLNA is the connection technology standard for all your home devices, be they TVs, cameras, cell phones, or tablets that we have we have here. It basically leverages the network you already have. So you've got a Wi-Fi network off in most people's homes. You may have Mocha, a home plug, something or else, perhaps some Ethernet. Leverage the network you've already got to enable all those devices to share AV seamlessly around the home. And so we've got a few demos here of, of things that we can do to, to do that kind of sharing. We've got two basic areas. One would be personal content. So obviously very popular. People take a lot of content on cameras, phones, and, and tablets that uh, they want to use around the home. Classic scenario is you, you're at a party, you want to share the photos, perhaps of your holiday or your trip in Vegas. And so that's one of the scenarios that we'll show. So Shane here is a tablet that's connected on the DLNA network. It's connected into the network of other devices. And he can see the device in the home network and he can take the content on here, uh, say a photo, and just swipe to the, the, the device, push the content directly to the TV. And so you can see it's coming across. So that's come in directly from the tablet. Seamless, no drivers, no wires, no nothing. Painless, it's totally almost seamless. instantaneous. Almost instantaneous. And it could have been, it could do on the Wi-Fi camera, it could have been on your, your, your cell phone, it could be any device you've got. Right. That's great. So that's great for personal content and you can share it and pull it from PCs and other places, NAS boxes, of course. The other element we're showing actually with our friends from Broadcom is uh, what we refer to as premium video. Mm -hmm. So not personal content, but premium uh, TV programs, etc., etc. So what we have here is a networked uh, whole home PVR style box, a reference design from Broadcom. It's got uh, live tuners coming in the back and it's obviously got PVR content on there. It's connected into a home network. In this case, this is our bedroom TV, um, connected in by Mocha and Wi-Fi to, to the rest of the home. And then this TV can pick up the live TV from this box, totally different room inside the house, uh, and get the content to, to play. So right now we have a live TV channel. If I come into the menu, uh, even though this this box here doesn't have uh, you know a coaxial cable coming in for 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 uh, Comcast, say, uh, I can come in here, go to the media player, and I can pick a channel that's coming from somewhere else in the home. So I pick another channel, and it's coming in from the box over the home network. Uh, out here into the bedroom. So that's great in our bedroom TV scenario. This could be mounted on the wall, Wi-Fi directly into your home, or perhaps a mocha with a coax cable. No center box needed. Really nice, seamless scenario. But of course, it could be the tablet too. The tablet could be out on the balcony, viewing the content uh, from the PPR and, and the rest of the home. Great. So that's basically dealing with demos, personal content, and premium content now too. And so now everything's connected. Everything's connected. End screen around your home. Great. Thanks for your time. No really problem. Appreciate it.